Kommt zurück. Also ich bin ich bin neu auf. Uh, wir haben einen Haufen Skill Points left. Um, das in the village. Okay. Das heißt, wir müssen jetzt auch mal hier da drüber. Ooh. You think you have a pretty hot suspect right now, don't you? That ruby of yours. Yeah, and I don't need this this right now. This chapter is closed. Yeah, and notice how it came together without casting too much suspicion on Classia. It was nice and ruby centric in the end. Thank you, Volition. What do you mean? Anything strike you a bit off about this mishmash? Könntest du aufhören, sie zu beschuldigen? Die ist so süß. War so nett zu uns. Und alle anderen Gedanken sind auf ihrer Seite. Nur du bist gegen sie. Was heißt Volition überhaupt? The bullet was jacketed. They don't just lie around everywhere, do they? Good point. It is rather rare these days. But do continue. Turned out the bullet True. Strange how you conducted the whole advanced ballistics analysis and then hand waved it. Footprints in the pinball workshop didn't fit with the odd soul's print on the crime scene. No, they didn't. Stimmt. So far, no one has mentioned hearing the shot. Notice how this hasn't come up at all. Even Hardy and his boys didn't mention it. Neither did you. Danke, Volition. Don't think I knew this. That's right. Finish thought. Just finish it and conveniently go on. She's watching you leave right now, you know that. Free as a bird on that roof, lighting up a cigarette and thinking, am I glad Ruby's in this shit and not me? Thank you, Volition. Don't listen to this guy. The theory was solid. He's just jealous. <laughs> Move on. It's no use harassing her further. Okay. Habe ich aufgenommen? Ja, ich nehme so. <lacht> Okay. Na gut, ähm, das bedeutet, wir gehen jetzt mal da drüber. Und das bedeutet auch, ich habe vergessen, meine Uhr zu stellen. Äh, ich habe sie nicht einmal in der Nähe, das ist nicht gut. Drüben liegt sie. Okay, auf 5 Minuten und dann machen wir weiter. Passt. Ähm. Gut, können wir mit dem... They don't know me. No one knows me. Nope, können wir nicht. Vielleicht können wir später nochmal mit ihm reden. Ah, warte, 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 warte. Vielleicht hat die Dame noch was. Inside, you see a set of steering levers, a radio microphone. This is Precinct 57. How may I assist you? Mm. Please connect me to Sylvie again. Did you find out more about the owner of the armor? Yes. Boots? It took some convincing, but I got the map oh. his name and a few biographical details. Are you ready? Natürlich, nur zu. The lieutenant leans in to listen. Notebook in hand. I was born ready, baby. Ah, <laughs> shoot. That suit of armor was issued to an Orani citizen named Elis Cortenaer. That's E-L-L-I-S-K-O-R-T-I-N-A-I-R. Exact date of birth, unknown. 
He was signed into the Lelystad County Neonatal Care Unit on 28th of February, 09. Hmm. Neonatal Care Unit? He was found as a newborn in a leaf compactor near an abandoned farm. He spent four months in the neonatal unit, survived apparently, and was assigned to a foster family at two. Ah. Okay. According to Klausia, Lele said his real name wasn't really his. Perhaps that's because he was fostered. Mm -hmm. This is what the ICP knows about him. He was raised by foster parents, entered the East Brand Military Academy in Vredefort at 17, then served in the Oranese forces till he was honorably discharged in 41, just a year before the Seminese conflict. Okay. Then the armor followed him to Seminine, or at least I assume it did. And that's it. There are no records of his employment in Crenel, or any of its other incarnations, or him even entering Ravachon. Okay, wait. He was found in a leaf compactor? Any information on his foster parents? So, all we have to connect him to Crenel is the armor? No, officer. Sorry. Even that is a small miracle. These organizations usually double-check their inventory. Thank you, Alice. Great work. Mm -hmm. No problem, Lieutenant. He was found in a leaf compactor? It's a garden tool used to press leaves into these cubes. It's a detail the hospital had. The only detail in these files. So I thought it would be good for you to know. Sure. It is. Thank you, Alice. Well... We have his name and service record now. A name? This is very good. Elise Cortenard. Hmm. We sind großartig. Sometimes police work is about human dignity. About giving back names to anonymous victims. Oder anonymous, anonymous uh, police officers. So wie wir jetzt wissen, wie wir heißen. I'm glad the inquiry was helpful to your investigation, officer. Did you have any other questions? I'm done with the radio for now. Ain't cool. Ah, uh, yeah, we wollen nicht mit dem 41st reden, oder? 57th, over and out. In the cabin, you see a set of steering wheels. Yeah, ja, yeah, ja, danke, wir gehen. Das kennen wir schon. Okay, wir haben noch einen XP gekriegt, sogar noch einen Skill Point gekriegt. Ich frage mich gerade, ob wir irgendwas steigern sollten. Ich meine, wir haben alles bis jetzt recht gut hingekriegt, ohne dass wir viel steigern mussten. Das ist. Ähm wir haben die, die Skill Points tatsächlich hauptsächlich dafür verwendet. Ich sehe gerade, ich habe noch Plätze frei. Ich würde fast sagen, und wir haben da noch drei Dinge zum Erforschen. Oder noch mehr, was weiß ich. Machen wir einen Unlock? Natürlich. Rigorous Self-Critique oder White Morning oder Date of Birth Generator. Uh, your face looks like it's 58 and your body feels like it's 60. Your mind feels like it's lived for one day or a hundred. Both longer than they ought. Das heißt, ich möchte herausfinden, wie alt ich bin oder wie. Hmm. For how long then? Es kostet nichts. Was ist das? Minus one authority, little guy gets further and further away. You see yourself from above, you're passed out on the blue tiles of the hostel room floor. Even from this distance, you can see your eyelids flutter. The dimension of great white object letting out its sweet smell. <gasps> wir dürfen nicht vergessen, am Abend Karaoke zu singen. Das haben wir noch vergessen. And look, he moves. The feeling animates him. Instinctively reaches out for the feeling's best friend. Bottle of Commodore Red. He puts on his disco clothes and gets smaller and smaller. 
Yeah, wir internalisieren den White Morning. Wir wollen wissen, was mit uns droht. Kostet 5 Stunden. Passt schon. Uh, wir müssen noch Karaoke singen. Sing Karaoke. Am Abend dann. Gott. Wir müssen. Wir hätten noch den Dory Driver fragen können, der, der gemeint hat, dass er eine richtige Lady ist und dass er nicht glaubt, dass Leute über sie sagen. Warte mal, waren da nicht die Typen? Was sind die Typen? Sprechen wir jetzt erstmal mit denen drüber. Okay, wir müssen da in die Richtung. Okay, fangen wir zuerst die ältere Dame. Our tenant, the policeman. I hope the waves don't keep you up at night. What can I help you with? Have you seen a red-haired woman named Ruby around the coast? Nay, I haven't seen anyone lately. Okay, but do you know who I'm talking about? This is my little cinder block town. I know what goes on around here. Yeah. She's being evasive. She knows something. There was a murder in Martinez. She might be a suspect. We would appreciate your help. Would you now? I know how this world works. And it doesn't work when people tell on each other. Yeah, girl. You know something? We're here to help. This is like when that man locked himself in the woodshed. We just need to help her come out. This isn't about the union, you know. You don't have to worry about retaliation. Ah, I should have known. This is yet another union mess. I'm not afraid of them, you know. We are not in the habit of being afraid around here. Hmm, I see. You know something, but you've decided not to tell us. Okay, but we'll be back later. If we find anything suspicious. There's not much to tell. People come and go. Now, was there something else? I see, ma'am. I hope you don't mind if we look around anyway. Mm. You should look around your shack. Maybe she's rented it out to others too. Mm. Ah, sie ist eine von den zwei, die die Unterschrift, wenn ich die Unterschrift brauche für den Everard. Sollen wir das fragen? Hey, what's this about? Come now, I can't read all this scribble. Tell me what it says. Everard wants to turn part of the village into a little youth center. Just a real estate deal, nothing business. Uh, actually, never mind, I won't bother you with this. Nothing good ever comes from paperwork, in my experience. Oh, sie würde das sicher unterschreiben, wenn wir sie geben würden. Wir sind gute Menschen. Goodbye, I'm off. Okay, schauen wir zuerst mal in unser Shack. Schauen wir mal, ob wir was finden von einer möglichen vorherigen Mieterin. Ooh. A brisk coastal wind still howls against the window of the shack. Occasionally, the waves crawl in under the foundation, producing a low hum. The room feels muffled, like you pulled your hat over your ears. Outside, it is cold and windy, but you're inside, and it feels safe and warm. 
Danke, Shivers. What is this place to you? Was? Wer war das? Diese Stimme kenne ich noch nicht. My new hangout, where I could silently sit, drink and die while looking at the waves roll in. My forward base for the coastal part of the operation. It's free. That's good enough. I could live here. A possible resting spot for my fugitive is what it is. Looks like this is my new home. Wonder where the old one went. Puh. Egal was ich jetzt sage, das war's. Was anderes kann ich nicht mehr sagen. Possible resting spot for my fugitive is what it is. It's free. It's good enough. I could live here. Hm. Wir sind, wir sind auf, der, auf dem Weg zum Superkorb zu werden. Also das ist meine Overhead, Base. you hear the forlorn shriek of seagulls. Far below the birds, a wooden boardwalk filled with abandoned stands, tables and benches, echoes from a long lost time. Ich frage mich gerade, was ich bei den anderen gehört hätte. A middle-aged man stands in a rundown shack on the edge of a fishing village, listening to the heater hum on the wall. This feels like a cozy hideout. Thank you, strange sensation, for a fair assessment of the current situation. No, wait, I changed my mind. I want to choose a bit. Ah, ich könnte zurückgehen. Nein, bitte. Outside, the howl of the wind has picked up. The waves crash against the stilts again. It's as if you think the thought, but in someone else's voice. Okay. Look under the floorboards. Okay, das kann ich machen. As you look at the floorboards in this corner of the shack, It's clear one of them isn't quite level with the others. The edge of a floorboard next to it looks scratched. Okay, we should. The edge of the floorboard next to it, it looks scratched. Move the board aside. Hollow space underneath the floorboards is dark and damp. You can barely make out the mixture of sand and sawdust. Bitte mach, dass das mein Revolver ist. Bitte mach, dass das mein Revolver ist. Bitte mach, dass das mein Revolver ist. What's in here? Nothing particular catches your eye. Looks like more reeds. There might be something hidden inside the sand, though. Something bad. Someone's night thoughts. A last resort. A bad idea. Es ist die Karte. Search through the sand. You stick your hand in and start combing through the sand. Dry, not like outside. Fine dust. And then... Something hard wrapped in paper. A small cylindrical object. You pull it out. A bullet. Oh, doch nicht meine Knarre. Eine 9 mm. A 9 mm bullet, to be exact. Fit for all muzzle loaders of that caliber. This bullet is like a murder weapon. The floorboard isn't interested. Maybe the washerwoman is. You have enough to confront her with. Holding okay. the bullet, you get the feeling this isn't ammunition against you. It's for herself. Okay. We shall see. Aber zuerst gehen wir raus zu Kim. Hätten wir das immer gehört? Gute Frage. Oh, interessant. Das White Envelope. Damit haben wir noch gar nicht interagiert. Die Bullet habe ich gar nicht. Ja, interessant. You take okay. the legal documents out okay, of the schon. envelope. A 12 to 40 month construction period. Okay, mit dem Haus. Ich habe schon recht lange nicht mehr da reingeschaut. Items. 
Zeug, Sachen, Clothes, Tools. You've got two bullets. Ah. Our tenant, the policeman. I hope the waves don't keep you up at night. Why was what can I help you with? Why was there a bullet under the floorboard of our ship? Damn that girl. A bullet? You didn't put it there, did you? She did. Gone and hid things in there? She's usually a good tenant. And not a stupid one, either. You rented the room to her? Yes. I let my room to that ruby girl. Mm-hmm. Na schau, und schon haben wir sie gefunden. Oder zumindest einen Dean von der Klinge. Wir sind so gut, wir sind so gut. Her hands move into the water bucket. Some water sloshes. As I've here. done before when she's been in trouble or just looking for solitude. I've made it clear. We welcome all kinds of people here. She came last Friday, left on Monday in a hurry. What has she gotten herself into, that girl? Yeah. She seems genuinely worried about her previous tenant. She's seen her hiding out from trouble before. But this seems different. Mm -hmm. That's for the police to find out. Right there. Please answer each question to the best of your ability. I'm sure we have a few. You there. Said she left on Monday. Yes, early with the dogs. Around 8 o'clock, I think. She probably heard the lieutenant's Kanema drive by, and it woke her up. Just like it did you. Must have heard your Kanema. Yes. That is a downside of having a 130 kilowatt engine. It lets the bad guys know when you are coming. Is the room exactly as she left it? I cleaned it, like I always do. Was there anything else? No. The truth, sire. Thank you, Arma. That's what I thought you gedacht. What is she like, Ruby? She's good company. Knows how to talk to an old woman. At my age, you don't get a lot of quality conversation. So I really appreciate that about her. Mm -hmm. Did she talk to you much during her last day? No, she was mostly silent this time. Kept to herself. She tried not to let it show, but I could tell she hadn't come to fish. Usually she likes to cross a few lines. But this time, she mostly stayed in her room. Okay. How do you think she left the bullet? How would I know? She's a gruff one, but not violent. She doesn't go around toting a gun. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not so sure. You could ask her about your hunch. That it was a desperate measure. See if she thinks Ruby fits the bill. I have a possible explanation Aye. in my mind. Do tell. This lies overhead, obviously a bad omen. We sind am Strand. Da fliegen die Dinger immer drüber. It's an exit plan. On second thought, I'd rather not say. It's not something I want to think about. Exit from what? The world. The lieutenant stops writing for a moment. He looks at you, then at the old woman. No, she's a fighter. Hmm. She really believes that. Hmm. you the server. I heard she was a heavy drinker with anger issues. You ever witnessed that kind of behavior? Nothing of the sort. Sure, she was no stranger to the bottle. She fit in that way. But I only knew her to have a beer on the beach while watching the sunset. Okay. She isn't what you call a drunk. 
He would offer me some from time to time. Said it was part of the communal life. But I never saw her lose control of herself the way some people do. <laughs> Said uns gesehen. Uh, did she have any technical equipment with her, like radio stuff? Not that I knew of, though she was into nice music. She once showed me a few mixtape milieu she'd made. Okay. Although I guess she was pretty handy with the mechanical and technical stuff. Even fixed the heater in the shack. What's you should be thing? thankful for that. Oh, sie hat das gesagt, was ich, was ich mir gleich gedacht habe. Nett von ihr, weil sonst hätte ich es jetzt nicht warm drinnen. Where did she go? I don't know. Further up the coast. She tried to leave quietly, but the hinges on that door screeched like a cat in heat. Woke me up. I heard her rushing in those heavy boots, heading up north. Okay. It's a peninsula. She might be trapped. You'll never find her, you know. She knows the coast like the back of her hand. You only just arrived. Yeah, but I've been disco. I wouldn't worry about that, ma'am. We are persistent. Further up the coast, we go then. I think this is huge. The needle in the haystack. Wipe your brow. Man, I was really hoping she'd be hiding in this village. Are you sure she didn't go somewhere more pleasant and less wet? Are you sure you would rather stay here? Get a nice cozy fire going in the heater? Seems like a better idea to me. Mm. No, you can do it. You still have plenty of juice in you before you drop. Hey, ich habe mal eine Endurance Probe geschafft. Okay, hat nur sechs gekostet, aber Das hätte ich sogar ohne einen Plus geschafft. Behind the Cinderblock houses, old pre-war ruins rise to the sky like dark palaces. The wind calls. Hmm. Goodbye. One Hello. thing, officer. If you do find her, please go easy on her. She really means it. It's an honest plea. She's a good girl. Whatever she's gotten herself mixed up in. Yeah, she verkauft Drogen. Or she schmuck. This is so or so kind of a besonders person, offensive. Okay. Na dann. Machen wir das. In diese Richtung bin ich eh noch nie gegangen. Da sind die zwei Burschen. Da drinnen war ich auch noch nicht. Okay, wir kommen jetzt in Gebiete, wo wir noch nicht waren bis jetzt. Okay. Feel safe and warm in here, not like outside. Oh, da ist noch ein Kind. Das ist ein Kind, oder? Hallo, Mister. Ah. A young girl, barely four or five years old, sits on the sofa. Oh, time up. Yeah, that's good. She clutches a small stuffed animal. Occasionally, she twirls it around. Uh, do you know anyone named Ruby? Ruby. Ruby. My mom tells me I'm a big girl, but she doesn't know that I can't say Earl. Or like, sometimes I can, but then Earl. Er. Earler. <laughs> Kids. Where are your parents? My mom's outside, and I don't really know about my dad. Okay. The twins outside your brother. Yes. They don't want to play with me. They're older and play outside. Okay. They look the same. <laughs> Sometimes I can't tell them apart. They look identical, right? They're the same thing. They look identical. 
<laughs> oh, Zeus. <laughs> What's that? Point at the stuffed bird hanging from the ceiling. It's a grouse. Okay, was this a grouse? You might be able to get on Gart's good side if you replace the broker skewer. You almost certainly broke. Yes, but what's it for? I don't know. Can I have it? I know someone who really likes stuffed birds. Sure, just go and get it. I don't like it anyway. It looks angry. Okay. All right. You just need to grab it from the ceiling and go. <laughs> das könnte problematisch werden. You're holding. It's Lammy. He's my friend. So, like. Oh. Lambie is a stuffed lamb that, admittedly, has seen better days. One of the eye buttons is missing, and the fur is tattered in several parts. Lambie looks like he's falling apart. He looks so... Oh, okay. Well, pleased to meet you, Lammy. Lammy usually doesn't like strangers. But you're also fuzzy, like Lammy. <laughs> oh, God. Wir schauen genauso zerstört aus wie das Lamm. Bye! Okay. Wir können den Vogel kriegen, vielleicht, wenn wir es schaffen. Das ist sicher eine Probe, die wir nicht schaffen. Industrial coal pads burned with an orange nicht gut. Wir versuchen es. Hey, das war einfacher als ich dachte. 1338. Großartig. Den schauen wir uns noch an. The dead body of a grouse stuffed with some unknown material. From a distance it might just pass off the real thing. The bird itself looked extremely ruffled and slightly grumpy. Großartig, sag ich da. Take stuffed bird to guard. Find ich gut, find ich gut. Na gut, meine Herrschaften. Ich wünsche euch einen schönen Nachmittag, Abend, sonst was. Ich hoffe, wir sehen uns bald wieder. Bis dann.